Alright, so I got snake, snake, fish. I thought I had fish up there a second ago. Maybe I didn't. Alright. Here goes nothing. There we go. I must not have had it on there. I thought I did. Maybe I clicked it one too many times. Sneaking increased. We're gonna take that. Hopefully it doesn't have any vital clues that I'm gonna ignore reading right now. <laughs> oh, frick, Skeever! Detected by something else. Another skeever. Hmm. Oh, cool. So I can close the gate behind me. I think I'm gonna do that. Okay, that burial urn is empty. Lesser soul gem? Alright, let's see what that's all about. Take that gold. And that. Friggin' skeevers. All the spider webs are not reassuring. I mean, granted, they could just, you know, be old stuff, but... Scroll of Fireball. Weak Paralysis Poison. Don't need the Linen Wrap. Okay, this looked like something on the top there. A st stone texture. Totally us. <laughs> oh, good. So I took all of it <laughs> using the game mechanics to cheat. Use the over-the-shoulder third-person perspective to see things that first-person won't let you. Alright, nothing in there. Hmm. Can I use my torch for that? Let's see if I can do that. Weapons. Is it in there? No. Miscellaneous, maybe? Is that where the torch? Torch. so I didn't need the torch after all. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Destruction. Sparks. Nope. Nope. Chazus. One sec, dude. You're gonna owe me after this. Don't let it get you. Boss fight! Oh. <laughs> so you're stuck. You can just hang out there for a second, buddy. I'll be right with you. Yeah, 
Yeah, yeah. Keep your britches on. Oh, jeez, frickin'. <laughs> Dead gum physics glitches. Oh, that's dangerous looking. Lockpick. If I help you, you're gonna give me that golden claw back. You did it. You killed it. Now cut me down before anything else shows up. Oh, whoops. <laughs> I was like, why is my camera panning? Where's the golden claw? Yes, the claw. I know how it works. The claw, the markings, the door in the hall of stories. I know how they all fit together. Oh. Help me down and I'll show you. Really? Leave the power the Nords have hidden there. Does it look like I can move? You have to cut me down first. Mm -hmm. What if I just cut your hand free? Or cut your hand off? See this lightning in my hand? You try anything, buddy? It's coming loose. I can feel it. You fool. Why should the treasure with anyone? Never should have come here. Call me a fool. Give me that golden claw. Jackass. Huh. Fool. <laughs> All right, let's see. Ha. Show me the money. That made me nervous for a second. I'm hearing all that shifting sand, and I'm like, mm -hmm. or shifting dust, or whatever. What is this? Ew. Embalming tools? Gross. This is like a mummification ritual here, or mummification, like room. This is where, this is where the mummies are made. Hmm. A soul gem. All right. Hmm. Jerk. Cut you loose. And everything. And you try to run. You know, now that I'm thinking about it, though, I should have let him live and let him run down here just to see what happened. Should have just chased him. What? Oh, 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 oh. Well, that was interesting. Ancient Nord sword, huh? Whoa! Corundrum ingot? Cool. Let's see, what is the ancient Nord sword like compared to my Imperial sword here? Damage 9, same damage. Okay, that's cool. Ah, that's a pretty brutal looking sword. Look at those, that's pretty cool actually. Alright, so my Magicka has replenished for the most part. So is my, my health is almost fully regenerated. That's good. So far, and I'm not complaining when I say this at all, I'm actually digging it. <laughs> Skyrim is uh, 
tried and true to the old RPGs because I've already faced... Oops! Picked up an iron sword. Let's see. We're gonna... Oops! Nope, nope. We're gonna drop that. But, uh, it tried and true to the old RPGs in that I've already fight... Uh, already fighting... <laughs> giant spiders and reanimated skeletons. Which is, like I said, I'm not complaining. It's fantastic, actually. Alright, nothing else here. Ooh, look at that. Gee, I wonder what happens if I walk in there. Is there any way to bypass it? Yeah, here we go. I almost wish I could... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> almost wish I or feel like I should walk through there anyway. I wonder if there's a way to like deactivate the trap. I mean, I love the fact that there's a simple way to bypass it, but oh, see, there's the that's a pressure pressure plate. Let's see if I can if I s can I step on it and then back. Oh God! Ouch! Jeez, I thought it was only gonna swing part of the way. I didn't know it was gonna swing all the way around. <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> well, that trap worked <laughs> through my own folly, but it worked. Oh, look at that! That dude's gonna get up. I'm almost positive. How was I detected? Let me see, I need to eat some food so I can regenerate some of this health here. Stamina, stamina. Hmm. Restores one point of health. Uh, that was a lot of that was a lot of uh a lot of carrots I just ate there. <laughs> Potatoes. Probably should have saved those. I wonder where you can learn recipes for like cooking stuff. Well, I guess now is as good a time as any. I knew you were going to get up. Whoa! Magic battle! Hey, I wonder if I can do this. He's probably going to follow me back through here, yep. Can I get you to w walk on the pressure plate? Come on. Come on, do it. Do it. Yes! <laughs> oh, that worked beautifully. I'm going to take that. <laughs> that was wonderful. I love that I actually had the ability to do, to do that. That was so great. Oh, man. Good job, Bethsaida. That was fantastic. That, that, was, that was one of the most enjoyable things I've done in a game in a really long time. All right. Let's see here. Oh, I leveled up. Open up the skills menu to level up. P. Tab. All right, level up. There we go. Oh wow, leveling up. When your level increases, you must choose to increase your health, magic, or stamina. You can also select a new perk at this time or save it for later. Available perks are highlighted in each constellation. Constellations. That's cool. Well, I'm gonna increase my health first. Hmm, conjuration. Destruction. Destruction, I think, is what I'm going to go with. Novice Destruction. Very cool. Alright, let's see. Do I have anything else to invest in? Requires 30. How do I tell what I have to invest? Alright, well, let's see. Um, 
Smithing heavy armor. Two hand so y that's right. You level that up by. Can I can I invest points in this? Oops. Okay, so it looks like I don't have don't have any more, or at least I can't do any more with that. Um, all right, let's go back to destruction. Let's see if I can do any more. Augmented to chop. Okay, so I can't require thirty destruction. Twenty-one. Okay, so that's how it works. All right. Oh! Oh crap! Ooh, that was close. See if I can pull the same thing on you guys I did on your buddy. Come on. Right this way. <laughs> Come on, keep walking. Oh, damn, he missed it. Nice. I love those kill shots. Oh, God! <laughs> wow. Can I take that? Oh, yeah, there we go. And actually, I don't, probably don't need to carry that. <laughs> Good God. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> uh, so what I was saying is I love those kill shots. Okay, that's the one I killed earlier. Oh, look at that ancient Nord bow. I like that, actually. I'm going to take that. Amethyst and gold. Very cool. Uh, but, yeah, I love... <laughs> I love those kill shots. They're so cool. I wish I knew how to trigger them. Uh, like, I, if there... I don't even know if there is a way to just manually trigger them, but... I can't believe that's thinking. Oh, that's nice. Got a frickin' pendulum blade puzzle. But, uh, oh man, that was <laughs> so funny. It was like really cool kill shot, and then friggin' thing swings open and nails me. <laughs> I think it nailed me. I don't know. It flung the corpse, that's for sure. Alright, here we go. Yeah, good guess. Skyrim, Tomb Raider. <laughs> okay, let's see. Do they have an explanation for this, or is this just a timing thing? All right, I'm trying to. I'm trying to see if I can figure out how to do a roll. You can sprint. Let me see, is there an option? There might not might not even be an option to do a roll. Let's see, sneak, sprint, run, run. Auto move? What's auto move? I'll have to check that out. Okay, so. Oh, okay. Auto move is like auto run. Okay. And now. Ouch! Okay. Oh, that was not good timing. Ah, dang it. Yeah, let's... Actually, can I leave that running? That hurt. That, that, that was not fun. Alright, let's see. Uh, I gotta take some more potions of healing here. What is this? What does this do? Blood freezing poison that does five points of damage to health. 
and stamina. Huh. Whoa, okay, that was healing. Am I gonna have any more of my undead buddies joining me here? Oh, here we go. Zappy, zappy. Ouch. Yeah. Ancient Nord battle. Line. What is that? Can I pick that up? Nope. Hey, let's see. Weapons. Ancient Nord bow. I'm about to disturb your slumber. Ooh. Where's my Imperial Sword? There we go. Zap. Yeah. Give me that gold. It's cool you kind of have the option to trigger it early, basically. Alright, let's see. Oh. Yeah. Love those kill shots. I'll try and get to the end of this dungeon before I end of the uh, end of the episode. I don't know if I'm going to or not. Those of you that have played this game and are watching are probably like, yes, or no. <laughs> so, but, you know what? This is a recording, and I have no way of hearing you saying yes or no, so. I love that you can switch between third, first and third person in this game, and I love that the combat feels good either way. Zappy zappy! Yeah. Is this really the end of it? Or is there something I'm missing? Feels like there should be more places to go. He said something about that gold, how the gold claw works and all that kind of stuff, so. What is this? Is this a... Ah. Alright, I'll go that way in a second. Took all of that. Hopefully this isn't a trap. I feel like this is like a secret passageway. What was that? It's a fern, okay. Ooh, neat. Hmm. Oh, can I take those? Glowing mushrooms. Hmm. Cool. Not sure what those will do, but I'm sure I'll find out eventually. Okay, well, I tell you what, this looks like kind of a, a little bit of a stopping point, so 
Um, <laughs> I don't know how much longer this dungeon is going to go. For all I know, the next episode I pick up, it's going to be, uh, you're going to get, it's going to be like right at the end of the dungeon. And if so, that will be, you know, like kind of a cool way to start it off. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and stop this episode here. And uh, I'll pick this back up the next time, um, the next time I start playing Skyrim. Um, you know, and I'm going to keep this fairly consistent. I'm going to be jumping back and forth between uh, each of the games I'm playing. So, um, but hopefully you guys have enjoyed this so far. Uh, it's been actually pretty fun. Um, it's been a really cool experience. I can see why this game has been, you know, so, so loved and such a good seller for so long. So, uh, anyways, um, hope you guys have been enjoying sharing this adventure with me. And, um, uh, I hope you guys continue to watch. If you, uh, don't mind, go ahead and slap that thumbs up button because that helps me out. Um, and, uh, if you, if you like what you're seeing and you'd like to see more of my stuff, hit that subscribe button. And, um, you know, if you want to, uh, get updates or just see silly little things that I post. I've got a Facebook page so you can uh, um, oh wow look at that skull over there I'll check that out later. <laughs> Sorry another rabbit trail. Anyways um, you can check out the Facebook page and uh, see what kind of stuff I post there. I, I, I update uh, you know when I when I upload a video you'll see I'll, I'll, I'll post it on there and share it as well. So um, but yeah if you guys uh, don't mind um, do some of that stuff and I will see you guys the next time uh, that uh, you either watch the next episode of this or something else. All right. <laughs> Anyways, uh, talk to you later, guys.